Continue our coverage of the Maui wildfires. One Bakersfield man has spent the last several days taking in residents of Lahaina, sheltering them in his apartment just outside of the historic island town. 23 ABC's Veronica Morley spoke with him about what they're experiencing on the ground level. Bakersfield native and Centennial High School graduate Chris Houston moved to Maui about a year ago, and he says it's been one of the best years of his life. But now his island paradise has turned to ashes due to the devastating wildfire, and now he's doing everything he can to help the community he loves. These are the most important people I've met in a long time, and, and they have nothing. Like, everything is gone. Chris Houston works at Captain Jack's Bar and Restaurant in the Lahaina Wharf. That was my group. That was my social group. That was my coworkers and friends. Houston saying he was off work and at home when he learned from a friend about the fires. There's a couple cool things going around to try and locate people. There's a Google Doc going around where people, have, you know, they'll put in a name of missing, and then if anybody has seen or confirmed that they're found, then they mark it found. But there's... um. Yeah, there's a couple of people that are still unaccountable uh, from our social group. Houston says it was three days before he heard from his best friend in Lahaina, and another two of his friends were unable to contact him because they lost their phones when they jumped into the ocean to escape the flames. You've got people that are safe, but nobody, nobody knows. And, you know, you start going a couple of days of not hearing from somebody and knowing that there's thousands of you know over a thousand people missing uh it's a struggle but there is still hope when they arrive at our shelter here they register the shelter into the shelter it's all computer system here so we know who is who and where is where i would say that most of the people here in our shelter have lost everything bakersfield red cross volunteers will be on the ground in maui assisting with recovery efforts for the next three weeks there's some tearful moments but i can tell you that Everywhere, everywhere I talk to is like, thank you, thank you for Red Cross. Meantime, Houston has been taking in residents from Lahaina and offering shelter in his own home. I'm blessed to have this place and, and I, this isn't like a weekend storm. This is going to be a long process. So I, I've already signed up and told people you can stay here for weeks, months, whatever, whatever it's going to take. And he feels the love from his hometown. I've had, I've had people back home ordering things at Target and we go pick them up and, and so just a huge thanks to everybody back home. And if you'd like to help Houston with his efforts in Maui, we have a link to contact him on this story on our website, turn to 23com For 23ABC News, I'm Veronica Morley, connecting you.